Oh, yeah, that's the other one that's bugged. Yep, let's go turn this in. Again, lightning you can spire, relax. or lightning in a bottle. I replace the spire components. I was just about to call in evacuation orders for the city. Well done. The rebel slaves will think twice before tampering with Imperial property again. Hmm. Yeah, I'll take that, I guess. Actually... You tend to get a lot of those. Get a lot of commendations too. I'll take that though, yeah. What the hell. I think that's better than the one I have. So it's five endurance, which is a three endurance. Eh, but it's two less willpower. Eh. Nope, should have grabbed the other thing. I don't think I have anything else that is um, slots on it. <laughs> slots. Alright, I'm going to go run in and train and sell and all that, and I'll uh, pick you guys up when I get to the trainer. Alright, I'm at the trainer, got a new version of Electrocute, just does a little bit more damage. Overload, that's the AE knockback, just again a little bit more damage. And I got my new heal, he's a friendly target for 448 to 479, uh, 3 second activation time, which is just their version of cast time. So, I will actually be... I say him to make boots. Uh, I will actually now be spending my two points to drop the cast time. Because... Uh, as you can see, the first point is 0.3 seconds. The next one is another 0.3 to basically drop it to a grand total of... Uh, by Drop it by 0.6 seconds. And I know that does not sound like a whole lot. But... Uh, <laughs> When you're in a pinch, it's actually quite a bit. And if you fall down that hole, you die. So, yeah, I will be switching my next two points will go into dark rending. Uh, I'm going to put that here. This will just go over here, I guess. That's the melee ability that I don't really use anymore. Because I'm not a melee class. Damn it. Damn it, I should have went to speak to Lord Crass. Uh, let me go do that real quick, let me, and I'll pick you back up. All right, I'm doing the social items quest. I've got the best hardware. And Buy the an best imperial prices. social badge. Good hunting. And I'm using it. And I'm using it in mega Sith fashion. I'm also gonna de. I mean, <sighs> I'm just gonna call it disenchant. Is that okay? And by the way, I don't care. I'm calling it disenchant gonna send him off to make more boots. It keeps saying zero, but I agree. Uh, and yeah, that doesn't seem to actually do anything. So anyway, that finishes up our social class quest, or social quest. Uh, and now I am going to go to speak to Lord Cross. Alright, we're about to talk to Lord Cross. My lord, I have reports from the conflict with the Republic. You have my thanks. You are, oh. if I'm not mistaken, the young Sith who took the Brental Star, yes? Tell me, what were your impressions of the Republic forces you fought? 
Well, he looks like he, uh, he, uh, <laughs> he must have killed Pyramid Head and, uh, took his face mask for shoulder pads. One Imperial soldier is worth twenty, thirty of the Republic's grunts. Then this should be a very short war. I thank you for your insight in these reports. If you'll excuse me, I must study them before giving the Minister of War his marching orders. Actually, in hindsight, I wish I would have answered that differently. Hmm. And that's kind of what I was hoping would happen. Hey, it's Mako. I had her for a while. She is, um... She's the companion you get for, yeah, mercenaries, I think. I don't know. Not that I'm a big role player, but, um... I kind of wanted to... Have my character be a brash asshole, but not stupid, right? But then I was thinking, well, maybe like now he's like right now he's brash and headstrong and overly confident. But maybe as he progresses, he becomes wiser and he would say something like, we must not overestimate our enemies. But yet at the same time, be like, yeah, we'll crush them like dogs. But, you know, still an asshole. But not an overconfident asshole. Enjoy your stay. I'm totally RPing. Like crazy. By level 50, I'm gonna be dressing up as my character, speaking in character at all times, asking for a transfer to an RP server. I should totally do an LP on an RP server. Totally. Dog. I've heard in general people in the RP servers are terrible players though. But to be fair, I think most people are terrible players. Though, I mean, well. I was going to say most people I've grouped with so far have been pretty competent, but I mean, we've been doing ridiculously easy content. In beta, when it was a little harder, people were seemed to be pretty competent, so I don't know. Uh, power crystals. Jimunda. I wanted to get some more power crystals before we get going. And we are going to... Sorry about constantly drawing the map up. I know that can get annoying, but I easily get lost. Alright, let's go ahead and hop on the speeder. Destination. Enjoy your stay. At 25, you can get your own speeder, by the way. Obviously, I don't think it goes quite this fast. I don't know, I never actually got one, so I can't ta say from personal experience, but I doubt it. Alright, that's that. Alright, for Colossus, I think we go out here and to the left, to the left, to the left. of power. Yeah, I can't sound like the Emperor at all. See, I don't need no Companion.
Alright, I'll stop killing random things. This is a pretty neat little area. This guy is messed up. Like, he looks weird, he is weird. And this, I remember in particular, this used to lag like crazy, but they fixed it. Because I bugged it. Well, no, I'm sure about a dozen exactly as reported. people bugged it. A degree six revolt, population equivalent to the Duros uprising on Zilior. Subjects occupy a moderate radius of jungle. Good. Good. Welcome, apprentice. Your timing couldn't be better. I'm not I an apprentice. Lord Drow. When the Empire encounters oh, wait, yes, resistance on its conquered worlds, they call me. I'm here to end the slave uprising on Drum and Cass. Welcome to the Imperial Capital, my lord. Just the right tone of obedience. You'll be an excellent asset here. Situation is this. A Sith Lord was constructing a colossal statue of himself in the jungle. His slaves revolted and armed themselves. The Colossus remains unfinished and well-armed slaves now control the jungle. An embarrassment for the Empire, but an opportunity for me. You are in some serious need of Nutricree or something. What can these renegade slaves possibly provide you? Test subjects, of course. A means of perfecting my techniques. I'm testing a toxic weapon, a poison called Quell. Its victims experience a prolonged state of agonizing pain before finally dying. The victim's allies are so horrified by Quell's effects, they lose their wills to resist. At least that's what I intend to prove. Sounds like a worthy cause. Yes. Cowing the masses is a complex art. It requires a great deal of fine-tuning. I need someone to introduce a controlled amount of Quell into the slave's water supply, so that I can determine the proper dosage. Work is dangerous, there will be armed slaves everywhere, but your success will be well rewarded. What do you say? I'll always aid in the advancement of the killing sciences. Science! I suspected as much. My assistant, Sergeant Slerin, will recommend the correct dosage of Quell and give you a supply. See him at the research tent. Sergeant Slaughter. God, he fails all the time on these missions. You failed me for the last time, Ken Vale. Ah! Okay. If I could force lightning you, I absolutely would. If I know Lord Drowell's tastes, which unfortunately I do, he sent you for the quell toxin. The sooner we get this done, the better. Impatient? Of course you are. My superior certainly knows how to choose his assistants. What if I told you this experiment is pointless? That past studies have shown increased suffering has no impact on the speed of surrender. This has nothing to do with accelerating the end of a rebellion. Lord Drow simply takes perverse thrill in gratuitous suffering. Yawn. As you see, Lord Drow <laughs> compromises efficiency for his own twisted fixations. I want this assignment over with. The faster this rebellion ends, the faster I'll be reassigned to more important work. Serving Lord Drow's bloodlust has stunted my career. If not for his inefficiency, I'd be a captain by now. If you let others block your progress, you deserve to fail. Why do you think we're having this discussion? Lord Drow's dosage of quell toxin will have slaves writhing in agony for pointless weeks, during which this area will remain volatile. I've prepared a dose that will kill the slaves efficiently, which is better for the Empire and for me. Will you deliver my dosage instead? I want these renegade slaves to pay for disobeying the Empire. You're not merely prolonging the slaves' agony, but my own as well. Committed to your work, aren't you? Very well. Take the quell toxin and inject it into the slave camp's water filtration systems. See Lord Drow for your payment when you're done. Hell yeah, they've got to suffer. No one stands against the Empire. Damn you bug nodes. There's so many of them too. Which, the reason you're seeing so many nodes is because one spawns, nobody can get it. And then another one spawns that you can get 
or node spawn that people can get, and that keeps happening until one sp another one until one spawns in that section that nobody can get, and then basically it just keeps happening until I can't really explain what I'm trying to say. Basically, what I'm saying is you've got so many nodes that can spawn in a section, and then all those nodes are eventually filled up with unharvestable nodes. I don't think that made any sense. Kill for the Empire. Need more slaves to kill while we wait. You have to wait for that nozzle to respawn. Kind of a pain. Oh well. Things like that really should respawn much faster. Well, there's stuff up here that we can get, so we'll just forget about that for now. Wrong key. I was trying to intimidate him. Oh wow, this is an elite. I didn't even notice. I was wondering why he had the audacity to still be alive. Shall we seed? I think we shall. I oh. Seriously, need some kind of um, AE attack. That's not that knockback. to respawn. I don't think these take too long. And these aren't specific. Like with the water filters, there's only very specific filters you can contaminate. With the water tanks that you have to destroy, you can destroy any six. Alright, getting bored already. Leaving.
Or am I going back up here again? Yeah, I thought it was somewhere different. It's funny, the enemies respawn very quickly, but the actual quest objectives, the main quest objectives, I guess, rather, do not spawn, respawn very quickly. these guys come from. Well, more XP, I guess. Get out of here for the crap respawns. We're going to make a circle around. Or something up here. Whoa, whoa, easy there. <laughs> Yikes. I think there's like an elite at the end of that. These uh, packs of guys have low HP. <laughs> and with this back turn, ain't that a shame? Yeah, she's an elite, I think. No, a champion. Ooh. She actually might be pretty tough. Level 11, though. Let's see if we can take her. whooping the hell out of the pet. Oh! <coughs> Excuse me, of course. <coughs> oh wait, what am I doing? I'm using the wrong heal. That's what I'm doing. Nope, wrong heal. I need to move up. Would you frickin' heal, please? Oh, 
shit. Ah, you son of a bitch. Right as if it's about to land. Gonna be close. God, he cannot tank that well. Haha, -ha, you suck. You shamed me today. Again! God, why can't he tank that well? I mean, I guess he does okay. But seriously, come on. I think I tanked her better than he did. She better have dropped something worth it, crap. Nope. Thanks, bitch. Well, you guys are going to pay for it. By the way, enough of lightning sound effects for you guys. I mean, is that, uh... If there's somebody out there with some kind of bizarre electricity fetish, this class is for you. Well, that was a mostly mostly uh, worthless excursion. It was a fun little fight, though, I guess. makes me even more disappointed in my little uh, buddy there. Now I see why he left you just hanging around in there. Because you're a huge disappointment. The hell? Oh. Yeah, that's how you do it. You do the quest objective, he grabs the minerals. Alright, a second tank. Looks like another one's over here. Only two more tanks. Or filters, rather. Two more filters, three more. Or, sorry, two more filters, three more tanks. 